Hey everybody, welcome back to JJ Speed Shop. Uh, we are outside today. Bob decided to show up. Buddy Tim's here. We both worked a uh, we worked a, a midnight shift last night, so we're we're suffering from a little bit of the midnight stupor. So bear with us. We'll be all right. We'll make it through. Uh, but to the old fox body again. And uh, the problem that I'm having is it's boost creeping up above where it's supposed to be. The uh, the wastegate spring down there is set at six psi. Uh, but it keeps over boosting up to the uh, the shutoff that I have a, a boost boost control shutoff wh whatever it's called. I put it in the tune at, at 12 psi. What we're gonna do is we're gonna try to steal it from the the Rambler in there. Uh, I've got a nice Rob parts tag for it too, and uh, we'll test it out on here, see what that does anything. And if it does, I'll order one of those, or or maybe we'll just take this wastegate apart and see what's going on with it. But stay tuned. That's what we're doing today. So uh, Tim had to go pick up his wife. So just just me now. Uh, we're gonna try to take this this wastegate off real quick. It's just a little band clamp. Why they use Allen's though? I gotta take those two. Um, one goes. This comes from the base controller. Got the band clamp off. Got to take off my vacuum lines, and then she's out. All right, let's go rob it from the old Rambler. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Now he mounted it really, really nice for me. Right here, look at that. Look how easy that is. <laughs> So now we're legit, you know. Part number requested NA because China doesn't put part numbers on anything. M and E, uh, it's, we're not. It's not a real one. Uh, yep, yep. I authorized it myself. Yep, we're at the station hut because. <laughs> Remove Ruby Station Hut. Also, only NA signature, and I'm a uh, employee number two. I assume Dad's number one. They did put a serial number, which I thought was weird. Um, but here, sorry, Dad. I'm starting to lose interest, but let's uh, let's throw this thing back in there because I drove here. This is the uh, this is my ride home, so I guess we got to fix it. <laughs> well, I got it back in. Tighten up the start to bolt now. That's awful close to the ground. I hope there's no big bumps. Yeah, whatever. We'll see what happens. Well, it's in there and plumbed. So we'll see. Go for a test drive. Hopefully, that doesn't drag the ground. 
But the real question is, I'm on the ground again. I thought we bought a shop for a reason. Ugh, this is terrible. It's time to clear it all out. Close the hood, make sure I didn't leave anything anywhere. I think we're okay. Throw the zip ties in the back because you never know when you need those. All right, well, let's see how it does. We'll see. Fingers crossed. I'm gonna have to put the phone down to drive to get out to the road. I can only shift and do all the things at once, you know? See you in a bit. All right, well, let's see what happens. supposed to work boost only saw 5.6 pounds or so didn't over boost or nothing all right well let's try uh let's see if i can shift in third we'll try third gear and see what that does so bad that it was it was starting to put a line on the drive shaft and it's aluminum and that that sounded really scary so well we're just we're gonna go play now it's what <laughs> golden hour like 5 6 p.m oh yeah is everything like a yellowy yeah golden hour i love it
does not hold it up to where it'll it'll have more boost than the six pound spring. No, I think I might have swapped the uh, the, the vacuum spigots. lines, or one of them came off. Maybe. Okay. I don't know. Let me take a look. I'm but, not really a good family uh, 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 a family photographer here. <laughs> I might have borrowed something from you. <laughs> There's something off my car. I did. Notice how the Mustang works now? <laughs> I, I sure did. But I left a professional tag there. 24 millimeter wastegate for Mustang station hut. Authorizing duty manager Jay Williams. That ain't Jay Williams. <laughs> this ain't this Jane. Part removed from Rambler. It's a Gigan. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah what, you took my waistcoat. I did. <laughs> mm, that's really nice. Huh. This is a JJ Speed Shop official form. Robbed <laughs> part. I've been robbed. <laughs> well, so you took the VS Racing wastegate off. I did. For your Mustang. I did. What's wrong with yours? I don't know, but this, this one's junk. <clears throat> so if you have on three performance and you're having issues with boost creep, buy a different wastegate. Huh. So. I think we figured it out. So there's a there's two different places that you can put the top nipple on the wastegate, and the top one's completely open. So because uh, I was not running a boost controller, you just shave this uh, down to perfection and throw that in there and see if that. Oh, 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 oh no! Oh gosh! Oh, that's a Ow. Your radiator's hot. Yeah, yeah, everything down here's hot. <clears throat> okay, give it a whirl. All right, here we go. Round two. Yeah. Well, we put the cap on the top of that wastegate, so hopefully that fixes it. That's a dog barking at your ear. Oh, it, yeah. That boost controller, the way it works, it puts air on the top, on the back side of the spring to increase the pressure of the spring. So it takes more pressure to overcome the spring and open it up. No. Oh yeah. If there's a big hole in the top, the pressure that's going to the top side of that isn't holding. So in, in theory, this should... And it'll pop off and allow the exhaust to escape and not have the boost it's supposed to. In theory, that little bolt we put in there should fix it. A lot of people out there walking their dog. 
Okay, so we're thinking maybe that's not where that's supposed to go. So we're gonna swap that vacuum port to the top and put the plug in over here. Maybe, I don't know, we'll give it a shot. All right, well, let's try that. Round 47. So how much boost before a stock five liter Mustang block windows? I don't know, they say, they say 500 horsepower is what they'll split up from the mains or whatever. But I have it in the tune where it shouldn't go over 11 and a half or 12, something like that. It's uh, 180 kilopascals, whatever that is in American units. I I think it's 11 and a half. It might okay. be 12 and a half. I don't, I don't know. But that's where my the boost cutout is. Okay. I mean, it's kind of a kind of exciting, kind of a disappointment, but uh, the, it's holding boost now. It's not over boosting to the moon and shutting off, but boost. the boost the boost controller is just not it's not working. If uh, if anybody has any ideas, uh, it's an AEM True Boost. I looked over all the vacuum diagrams and all that, and it looks right. Uh, it it worked with the old wastegate, but it would also boost to the moon. So who knows? The old uh, wastegate was the fact the on three. Yeah, yeah, the original on three that came with the kit, uh, but I, I'm not sure. The VS racing one works from my Rambler. From the Rambler, I robbed it. Yeah, I sure did. did. Uh, so anyway, I think that's it for today. AMF. <laughs>